Oh, hey gang. <laughs> Doing this a little bit more because, uh, uh, well, I kind of feel like I kind of need to. Um, just almost seems like just a few seconds after 3 o'clock, I kid you not, there was screaming coming from over here. <laughs> And I was like, what happened? Did some, somebody get hurt? Somebody, what, what, what's going on here? And it turns out it's this bunch of kids running onto the field trying to find these eggs and I don't know what else. And looks like there's some adults out there too. So, yeah, pretty good sized crowd out there helping out and, uh, and all that, but... Boy, hey, you don't want to hear screaming on a Saturday afternoon. And you got busy traffic. You got, uh, you know, it, it, it was just insane. It scared the crap out of me, I'll tell you the truth. And, uh, oh, man. But yeah, I a pretty pretty good sized crowd over there, but doesn't really look like a whole lot of people over there. And, uh, and I'll bet you about anything, there's gonna probably be about a dozen or so eggs still over there when the whole thing's over with. So there's probably gonna be a lot of eggs getting stepped on for the next week or so. <laughs> and uh, there's gonna be a lot of complaints about about rotten egg smell and everything like that. So he's just going to sit there and go like, what do you want us to do about it? And I'll tell you, man, it, it kind of makes me want to be a kid again participating in this because every time we had a we had an Easter egg hunt in, uh, in my hometown of Monmouth, Illinois, Sure, drive around in a booze truck. Like, like nobody's gonna try and take over the. Well, I don't know, it's CR England, so I imagine nobody's gonna go for that. They're gonna go for something more American, like Jack Daniels. Anyway, uh, when I was a kid in my uh, hometown of Monmouth, Illinois, you know, we always there was always an Easter egg hunt, and we'd always just go running all over the place and try to get eggs and everything like that. It was always a lot of fun. Of course, waking up Easter morning, the Easter Bunny left a basket full of goodies for us. Of course, I always hated those marshmallow candies. Always hated them. Those Cadbury eggs. Couldn't stand those either. But the Easter Bunny was nice enough to give them to me and I just trade them off for something else like more jelly beans or, you know, or, or uh, you know, chocolate covered chocolate filled egg or something like that. Because <laughs> that's what I like, you know. I just you know, and the marshmallow candies I give them to dad and mom because they loved them. And, uh, yeah. So anyway, gang, just wanted to show you guys real, real quick, I guess pretty much the uh, the aftermath of the screaming. <laughs> so yeah, just a bunch of kids getting out there trying to find eggs, and, and if there's a special egg out there, you can probably bet one thing, some privileged kid probably got it. So thanks for watching, everybody. God bless you all. Hope you had an awesome day. Hope you enjoyed the video, and if you like my videos, please feel free to subscribe, and let's stop trying to destroy the world. Let's help others who really, really need it right now. Let's keep praying this virus nonsense is going to stop very, very soon, and whether or not you believe in God, He believes in you. If you would help a fellow YouTuber reach 100 subscribers, 1,000 subscribers, 10,000 or 100,000 subscribers, I'm still trying to get to 500 myself and hope to get there very, very soon. With you guys' help, it can happen. And any goals you want to try to achieve in life, hope you get there and get there soon. As long as it's legal, nobody can search, especially yourself. And always remember, you're here for a reason, but if you weren't here, you would be missed. Take care of yourselves. Try to be good. Try to be good yourself. Try to be good to others. Till we do this again, as always, stay strong and rock on.